see I'm not going on that one, too. <laughs> This is the uh, post bar interview. She, she would have been the complete opposite of pleased. <laughs> <laughs> the complete opposite. I don't want to do that copy I don't want to take it on the top. You never called me when you were hammered? No, no, seriously. I was you were serious. always with me when I got hammered after. I mean, before. I was pre serious. Days. I could not find the house last night. How did you get here? Did you walk upstairs that evening? Yeah, I, I came very. I came within an inch of becoming a felon. <laughs> last night. Okay. Why? What happened? Somehow, with my upstanding moral character, I had to fight <laughs> off the extreme yeah, urge to steal a bicycle last night <laughs> and to ride up here. <laughs> there were many unlocked bicycles. I know. I wanted to and do I that like, too. <laughs> <laughs> but I didn't. You didn't do it? Oh. Uh -huh. Sure. Did you walk up the stairs at the church or the one towards the key house? Oh. Do you remember? Are there two steps? I did not know that. <laughs> I walked up the stairs that we walked down. And I walked up those stairs. Next to the stable, where the horse piece is on. As I was walking up the stairs, this is very strange. As I was walking up the stairs, there was either somebody behind me or somebody who had gone ahead of me and had walked off the stairs and who said to me, are you ready for this? You sure you want to hear this this early in the morning? They said, I want to suck your dick. And it was a guy. <laughs> oh. I did not. So you know what I did? Okay, I decided it was too dark and I was too drunk to like be crashing around the bushes trying to find the guy to beat the shit out of him. <laughs> so I went upstairs and like hid behind a wall and waited there for seriously like, 10 minutes looking at the top of the stairs waiting for somebody to come out of there because I was seriously going to fucking fly over there and <laughs> kick the fuck out of him. I really, I was going to bash his head with a rock. <laughs> and nobody came up. Are you sure that someone said that? I'm it's positive. A of your imagination. No, I'm totally positive. That was insulted beyond words. I agree. I Oh, Just bring me two down if you aren't bringing the whole bottle. Oh, this is asking. Just let him get Let him Don't take that one, take that one. I don't know if you're arthritic knees. I don't know if I've got a knee to My knees hurt so bad when I get up in the morning. Can you turn that camera off? Was it like the last, was it the last time last night? Mm-hmm. What's your impression of the wedding? There's the dog. Little dog. Little dog. Oh God, you're a baby. Do you still want to have a little Mackinac Island, Hamilton Cottage, 1891, historic site number 34. And there's a spider. Where? No, right there. Oh. Itty bitty spider. I need to die. Oh, <laughs> there was a spider. <laughs> <laughs> and and how was it? Good. <laughs> what is that? What is that on your mouth, Kathy? Crap. Sorry. Whatever it was, Bob ate it. <laughs> it must have been good. It was a piece of a Fruit Loop <laughs> from your breakfast. Man, does these jacks sit in your breakfast? 
Mm-hmm. How's Will? He's doing fine. Is he? he was, got mad because Mom put him down to answer the phone, so I had to let her go. <laughs> Mom said he's saying, Dada. Dada. Yeah, I told you he'd be saying Dada first, not this mama crap. <laughs> she was trying to train him to say Mama. mama. Last four months of his life. <laughs> I'll go, Mama. Say, Mama. Mama. No, <laughs> yeah, Is that true? Dada must be easier to say. Yeah, Mom's the baby's always say Dada first. But it's not because they're really calling their dad. It's because it's just an easier sound. Dada. Dada. I would think Mama's easier to say than Dada. Mama. Dada. Mama. Uh, well, here we are at beautiful Mackinac Island. And isn't it a beautiful day outside? Let's just go outside. It's a beautiful morning. Let's, let's show everybody the beautiful weather we got here. Yeah, it was nice yesterday, but unfortunately we didn't have we a got, yesterday. We got the cloud layer at about fucking 200 feet. <laughs> Don't go out too far because we're going to get the camera all wet. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely definitely raining a lot. We run a porch. Hi. Right. He's uh, not ready yet. I hear horses. No, he's not in bed. As a matter of fact, there are horses. Here, let me just for a second. Oh, it's oh. not going to go through the door, is it? Oh, my God. And I'm going to show you the horses. There are horses back here somewhere. Horses and bicycles. This is the place for horses and bicycles. Hey, Trigger! Trigger! I want a Trigger Burger! <laughs> Not, he says. Come here, buddy! Hey! Hi! Hi! Hi, come here! Come over here, buddy! Hi! Come on! Come here, fella. Come here, fella. Here he comes. Dun 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 He's a big horse. Okay, we'll go back. Hi. That's my umbrella? Yes, it is. Good boy. Yes, you are a good boy. Yes. All right, we gotta go. Bob's calling us. There's 
Bob. Who's Bob? He's calling us. He's saying, get over here. Hey, Bob! Wave! See, we can see him. All right. Hi. Hi, Will. Why do you watch this in like two million years? Hi, Mr. and Mrs. Pio. Chris, it's a felon. Hi, honey. Love you, baby. Love you, too. Okay. He's a big asshole. He was? Lovely Keo Cottage. Hey, Tammy. The man, the legend, the felon. John and Mary? Hi there. Mrs. George? Hey. How's it going? Let's see the blister. Let's see the blister, Kathy. You know, where is it? Wait, hold it still. It's a blister. Tammy eating bacon. Tammy eating a lot of bacon. <laughs> Colleen walking by to go get another drink. Her 15th one in the past hour. <laughs> now look at that couple. Is that not a good looking couple? Bob and the John and the wife to be Mr. Keel. You got everybody here. There's the bartender. The harried bartender. He's been through it all. Look at him. And says he's just stuck. He knows how to make a good Bloody Mary, I can tell you that. There's the Bloody Mary stuff. What? What do you think about Ross Perot? It's a family affair, otherwise I'd say more. What else do you want to know? You want to know about Clint? Clint Willie. Scumbag. Well, let's see, I caught your bouquet. Did you throw your bouquet, Tammy? Yeah, but I'm from Oh. I know. I had it. What did you throw yours? Have you caught it? Yeah. Are you guys going back tonight or tomorrow? I think we're going to go tomorrow. 
Well, there it, it doesn't when I hold it like this, but when I get up close like this, look. I can't see it. I can't see him, period. Hold it away from you and see if you can see it. Now you can see him? There's something wrong. Wait, let me see something. You have to move the lens out. Well, I know. Turn the... Where are you focusing? Wait, look. Turn this off. Just turn it off so we're not wasting tape. Oh, I'll still keep.
Make him laugh, John. Do the like you were doing. Make him laugh with that boot. Oh, The show's over. We were too late getting the camera together. Yeah, I just didn't have the thing pulled out. The little lens thing. Will! I need to charge the battery up too. August 14th, 1992, six days before Will's five-month birthday. <laughs> what do you think of that, Will? <laughs> Ufinko would be excited to be five months old? Ufinko know how to turn over? <laughs> Will, talk for us. Yes. <laughs> Will, Will, okay. Bye.